da 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 Next, uh, card games, uh, card, card games that I want to talk about. Actually, is it really a card game? Really what it is, is it's, it's a, it's a deck of cards. So, when we think of card games in America, we generally think of poker or similar style of games where there is numbered cards and then there are face cards like a, a king and a queen and a joker and all of that, uh, different color cards, you know. But actually, in Japan, they have something called Hanafuda, where the cards themselves are unique and individual, and they have their own uh, st uh, images, their own pictures that they are trying to to show. And let me see if I can um, draw this up. Yeah, right. Very beautiful cards. And there's no actual rule for what picture is on the cards, but except that they have to follow a certain theme. And Hanafuda cards generally follow themes based on the months of the year, the seasons, and certain historical events in Japanese history. So, Hanafuda not really is the it's not really the game. It's not a game. Really, it's it is a particular card deck. But what are the games? Well, if you're Japanese, or you're, you, maybe you or your parents or your grandparents will know some of these games. You play with Hanafuda cards. You don't play with, you know, poker cards or anything else. You play with Hanafuda cards, which, as you can see on my screen, uh, have very stylized images. Koei Koei, uh, Sakura, Hachi Hachi, um, Tensho. Um, and in a, in a bit, uh, and next I'm going to talk about, uh, Garuda, which, which is different than Hanafuda, but Hanafuda really comes first. But why am I talking about Hanafuda? Well, I, I thought I'd talk about Hanafuda because it's how Nintendo got its start. Yeah, that's right. Nintendo, the video game company. It wasn't always a video game company. Actually, did you know that in that in uh, Nintendo's history, um, it was actually a card manufacturer. They made Hanafuda cards. And um, during World War II and after World War II, when uh, Western cards became more popular, um, uh, yeah, Nintendo uh, walked in and said, hey, we already make cards. We'll, we will make uh, poker cards for you. Um, and so they were the first Japanese company to make American-style poker cards that are Japanese <laughs> um, because they were already making playing cards, uh, uh, Hanafuda cards. And I think that's pretty, I think that's pretty interesting. 